hi lovelies welcome back to my channel but if you are new here hi my name is taylor i post new nail tutorials every week so if these are the type of videos you enjoy feel free to click that subscribe button and turn your notifications on so you don't miss out whenever i upload a new video so today's video is going to be a little bit different i'm sharing with you guys my kara sky haul now some of the stuff that i picked up are new but the majority of it is just a restock it's not a stranger to my channel you guys have seen it many times so the first thing i'm sharing with you is the Kara Sky 100% Pure Acetone. Now it does match my hand sanitizer and I wanted to display it on my nail trolley. Next up we have one of my Holy Grails. Now this is just a restock and this is the Kara Sky EMA Monomer and I did pick up two of the 16 ounce size bottles. However after placing this order, or well, I should say not too long after I placed this order they did launch their one gallon size. So if you guys are on the market for a really good monomer that does have a low odor I will definitely recommend this one. It is one of my favorite monomers that I've used to this day and that's why I always keep restocking it because I never wanted to run out now i already own the kara sky size 10 and size 12 acrylic brushes but i did decide to pick up a size 14 because i've never really used a size 14 in my entire nail career so i just wanted to try it out now these brushes are amazing however they don't come pinched so if you guys are interested in working with a pinched brush i do have a video on my instagram showing you how to properly pinch your brushes i did pinch both my 10 and 12 and i absolutely love it and this is just about pretty personal preference if you prefer to work with a wrong brush or an oval shaped brush. I did go ahead and pick up a new dust brush. Now this is just so cute and it looks adorable on my nail cart. Now I had one previously. You can wash them in order to sanitize them and reuse it and I just felt like I washed that one enough and I'm not getting it back to those nice pink bristles so I decided to go ahead and replace it. This is another restock and this is the Kara Sky 80 100 grit pink buffer block. You guys know how much I use this in my videos and I was actually running low. So I did go ahead and pick up three packs of these and in each pack you do get 10 buffer blocks. So these two files were supposed to be part of the soak off kit however I was missing the pack of buffers as well as a rose scented cuticle oil. Now Kiara Sky customer service is on top of things so we got that rectified. I also picked up three of the sprinkle on glitters. Now these are three new shades and I am going to be swatching these out for you guys at the end of the video but I'm just giving you a quick preview as to the names and what they look like. And I've come to the end of my haul. The last thing I picked up was the Kara Sky Flaming Gale collection. Now this collection does come with six new colors. There is an entire collection, meaning there's the all-in-one powders as well as the gel polishes to match and the nail lacquers. But for me, I just really wanted the all-in-one powders. Because it spoke to me when I saw it, I realized it fits perfectly for all the seasons coming up to the end of the year. And I just loved it. So I am going to be swatching the entire collection for you guys as well as the three new sprinkle on glitters I just picked up. And usually I always allow you guys to just watch my swatches and I don't see anything but today I decided to give you guys my live reaction while swatching these powders. So first up I am going to be swatching Let's Flame and Gale and it's a really nice nail bed color but it's more on the pinky side. And to do my swatches today, I am using my Kiara Sky number 12 acrylic brush as well as my Kiara Sky monomer. Now I do prefer to swatch on clear swatch sticks so that way I can see how opaque or translucent these colors are. Now one thing I can say immediately from starting these swatches is that the formula feels finer compared to the regular Kiara Sky all-in-one powders that I previously own like this formula it is so smooth and easy to work with like it doesn't set up as fast so you do have time to work with it as well as once you place that bead where it needs to be it's not moving anywhere and even though the previous bead has already started to set there is a seamless blend between the two beads that I placed on the nail and I could continuously keep passing my brush over this application to make it as smooth as possible and that acrylic still hasn't fully set as yet so I can still move Move it into place with whatever liquid I have in my brush and this color is just so pretty I can see it with a nice deep white French or you can just apply this color on its own and put some rhinestones on it and that would be absolutely stunning as well. Just... 
next up we have peach bomb and the name is so funny but i love it this is also a nude but it's more on the beige side and i must say it is so freaking pretty oh my gosh i love shades of nude like these because they do pair perfectly with so many different skin tones and it does work well as a background for any nail art design Ooh, this color is so opaque and sexy and I'm in love with it. I think I wanted to use this on my next set. Next color that I'm going to be swatching is called Tequila Lime. And these names, y'all, these names are so unique. So whoever comes up with these names are so talented. But this is a gorgeous green color. It is perfect for Halloween. And as soon as they launched this collection, this is the color that made me get it. Because I fell in love with this shade of green. It's not too bright, but it's not too pastel. It's just like right there in the middle and it's just so gorgeous after swatching this particular color i must say out of all the colors that i've swatched this one was like freaking butter it was so smooth to apply the acrylic powder of itself felt even finer than the other powders out of this collection like it was mind-blowing Now we're going to be swatching Drop the Beat <laughs> and this is a really sexy purple to be honest but I was a little bit surprised when I swatched it because I was expecting it to be like a lilac or maybe even lighter but it turned out so pretty and my sister is a total purple fanatic and she will go nuts for this color. Another thing that I noticed about these powders is that they are clear base, not white. So therefore there is no white acrylic in it that is going to cause extreme marbling with the pigment inside of these powders, which is fantastic. So therefore you get a nice smooth blend with each bead that you place on the nail, which is what we are looking for in any acrylic powder because that makes our job so much easier.
So next up we have Foreshore and there's actually a place in Trinidad we call the Foreshore and it's a seafront view so this blue is fitting for it. Now again it's not as light as you see it in the bottle. It did swatch a little bit darker but it's still such a gorgeous blue though like I am loving it. Like I can see this being perfect for Christmas nails or winter nails you know something like that i can see it in a nice marble like there's so many different things that this blue is just going to look stunning in i'm not sure yet what nail designs that i'll be doing for the holiday season but for sure i'll be using <laughs> i'll be using this color And the last color in this collection is called Peeling Good. <laughs> and it is a really pretty orange. Like, it is really perfect for Halloween, Thanksgiving, fall. Even those upcoming summer nails. Like, it's so versatile and it can be fitted into so many nail designs. Now, if you are an OG on my channel, you know that I have a problem with orange acrylic powders. Because they always tend to marble. But, but this one ha, let me tell you guys zero marbling like it is so hard to get the perfect orange acrylic powder and so far this one is definitely a must-have like this orange did not marble one bit you guys see the application on this all i'm going to say is if you're having issues with orange acrylic powders i'll recommend this one trust me it is, guys, I am blown by how perfect this orange applied. Like, huh, I am shook. I am really shook. I am so happy that I finally found an orange that works so perfect. Ah, guys, oh, oh my gosh. all right so here we have all six colors swatched and they did dry so this is what the final result is going to look like so guys tell me in the comment section below which colors you think i should use in my next set because i have zero clue as to what i want to do on my nails and these are all in one powders so which means they can also be used as dip powders on the Kara sky instagram page they did pair the flaming gear collection with some of their sprinkle on glitters so i already owned three shades that they posted so i just went ahead and picked up the three that i didn't have which is this first one is bruja and it's this gorgeous copper color and i'm just using the Kara sky no wipe gel top goes and i'm going to put that inside of my pop stick and i'm just going to literally sprinkle that on So this next one we have here is called Oil and it is a really pretty blue, very suited for the Christmas winter season nail designs or you can mix it with some chunkier glitters and encapsulate it either way it works fine and that is the thing about having these glitters not mixed with any acrylic you can do so much with them and these glitters are on the iridescent side but for some reason my camera is not picking it up finally we have intergalactic now this is a clear iridescent glitter with a purple hue to it now it really does look absolutely stunning even when it's cured and i can see this being so perfect for like sugar snowflake nails absolutely gorgeous 
So these are the three glitters that I was missing to complete the glitters that they recommended to go with the Flaming Gale collection. Here is what the entire collection looks like paired with those sprinkle on glitters and I must say they did a really great job at pairing them together. So from left to right of the screen we have Let's Flaming Gale paired with Pink Tierra, Peach Bum paired with Bruja, Peel and Good paired with I Love You, Tequila Lime paired with Perfect. For sure, paired with O Wheel and Drop the Beat, paired with Intergalactic. Absolutely stunning colors. And if you guys are interested in any of the products that I mentioned or swatched in today's video, I will have them listed and linked in my description box below, as well as my Kiara Sky 10% off discount code. So that is it for today's video. If you enjoy these types of videos, definitely give it a thumbs up. And I'll post more of these for you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're having an amazing day or night, whatever time it is where you're watching from right now. As always, I would love for you guys to stay glamorous. Be safe and I'll see you soon.